Hey, welcome back to Being a Good Citizen 101. Hey guys, welcome back to our YouTube channel. So this video will be showing you how to make slime. Um. Not necessarily slime, but the purpose of this video will be showing is how primary school students can become more patriotic, environmental friendly, and civil. Now, primary school students have a nasty and disgusting behavior in the classrooms. It has been noted since way back, but in this generation, it has become more serious. And in this society, we must protect our kids at all costs because these kids, right here, these kids, and all of us are an asset to our society. For primary school students, more because they are the younger generation. Also, in this video, we'll be showing you the process and which qualities these students can not only be better for themselves, but better in the society to help us in the longer run. How can you become the future of police? Being a primary school student, have you ever asked yourself, what is it in our community you can contribute at this age? There are small things like being civil, being environmentally friendly, and being patriotic that you can contribute to having a better belief for our future generations to come. Therefore, primary school students in Belize can become better citizens by developing civic pride. Being environmentally friendly. Be environmentally friendly. Primary school students can contribute to this by firstly, properly disposing their garbage. Oftentimes, I have noticed that anywhere I go, primary school students that may have a plastic chips bag or a plastic wrap or something, they would just throw it on the floor. That is definitely not necessary. So these children do this because there may not be a garbage can around. But what they need to realize is that they should hold it in their hands until they find a garbage can that they could properly dispose it. Now, other things that they can do is recycle, reduce, and reuse. Recycle used bottles. There are different areas in these whereby they could recycle these plastics that could be used for other stuff. Now, when it comes to reducing, they can be environmentally friendly by instead of using plastic cups and plastic bottles, they could use metal bottles that they could use every day and just refill with water. No, instead of styrofoam plates, they could use biodegradable plates, which in Belize, they are starting to use now. No, reusing water, plastic bottles, and papers. That relates to reducing too, because when you reuse, you reduce the amount that you use. So basically, instead of buying water bottles every day, so basically, buying a bottle of water every day doesn't make sense. It's okay. one bottle every day. Hmm? I have spoken to several primary school students and asked them what have they been taught in school about keeping the environment clean. Now, ask yourself, what have you done to keep the environment clean? Now, there are many things that you can do, which includes what I had previously mentioned, recycling, reducing, and reusing. You are the future of Belize, so you could. <sighs> okay. So you could incorporate all those stuff that makes. What? You could what? Okay. So you could incorporate all these stuff and make Belize clean and become environmentally friendly. And these are some examples of being environmentally friendly. Being civil. Be civil. Practicing good manners and respect. Respect your elders and greet them the time of the day. Not because you're the younger generation means you shouldn't be the example. Be the example for the older ones. Have the manners and show that you are the future of Belize. I've observed that student, primary school students inside the classroom have a behavior of misbehaving and practicing disrespect towards your educators. 
you should learn to behave inside the classroom, be polite and helpful to your other peers, abide by the rules and regulations, and this not only applies for outside of the classroom, inside of the classroom, but also for outside of the classroom. Simple, following the laws of the least. Not because you're the younger generation means you can break the laws. No, you have to be the example for the upcoming generation. Respect the property of others. Now, this is very important. Students tend to think that it's okay to take the property of others without permission. No, you must ask before taking someone else's property. And this is one way can be a civil student. <laughs>「Be patriotic」When singing the national anthem, stand with attention and with great posture. For instance, place both hands to the side and feet together and look forward. No talking with your friends or playing with them. And take great pride in singing the national anthem. When reciting the pledge, place the right hand side to the left hand side of your chest. And stand with attention and place your left hand to the side of your thigh. And here is an example of being bitchotty. So, with all of that being said, thank you for watching our video, and until we meet again.